Welcome guys to our YouTube channel. My name is John K. Mwansa. In today's video, we'll be answering the question which is coming from the past paper 2019 science paper 2. So, um, our question states that the diagram below shows atoms of sodium and chlorine. So, here we have an um, atom of sodium and here we have an uh, atom of chlorine. Then, A. State the type of bond that exists in the compound formed when sodium and chlorine combine. So, technically, our question is coming from the uh, topic which is called bonding. Eh? So, when we define bonding, we say that bonding is the joining together of atom to form a bond. There are two types of bonding, which is um, ionic bonding and covalent bonding. So, our answer, <coughs> which is suitable for A, is a uh, ionic bonding. Why? Because ionic bonding is the type of bond that occurs between metals and non-metals. Here we have a metal sodium and chlorine, a non-metal. So our answer here is ionic bonding for A. Then B, they are telling us to draw the structure of the compound formed when sodium and chlorine combine. So, um... In ionic bonding, they say that metals loses electrons. The non-metals, they gain electrons. So here, this sodium, it's going to lose its electrons in its outermost shell. And this chlorine is going to gain for them to, to, to gain stability or to be stable. So our structure is going to be like this. Um, the sodium is going to lose, then this one, it, it's going to... Again, so we are going to write first uh, for sodium. So for sodium, it's going to have uh, two, one, two. So we have uh, one here, one there, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Then um. Chlorine. So here, uh, sodium has lost uh, one electron, then uh, chlorine uh, gained one. Here is how the structure is supposed to be. Then the um, question B2, state the chemical formula for sodium chloride. So the chemical formula for sodium chloride, it's... Um, and NaCl. This is the chemical formula for sodium chloride. Then C. Explain in terms of bonding and structure why sodium chloride has the following properties. Number one, as I said, number one, which is C1, a very high melting point. It's because of the strong intermolecular forces between atoms. Then C2. High electrically conductive when in molten because of the charges um, that um, sodium possesses and, and chlorine possesses, which are a positive and a negative charge. Uh, thanks for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.